Amica. I'm Derek Ray, joined by Lee Dixon in the commentary position. And if the game is as enticing on the pitch as it looks on paper, we're not going to be disappointed. It is Villarreal against Girona. Yeah, Derek, cracking atmosphere as usual here. That will lead to a nervy, energetic start. Frenetic, fast play to begin with before it all settles down. I'm really looking forward to this one. Con el dos, Mario Gaspar. Con el tres, Raúl Albiol. The Villarreal starting 11. Well, there's no great mystery, is there? We know normally how they're going to play, and it's all about applying as much pressure as possible. Lee, can we anticipate seeing more of the same today? Yeah, absolutely, Derek. If you're really good at something, then why not? They're very good at this. All the team members have bought into this style of play. One player slacks off and it all falls apart, though. Parejo. Manu Trigueros has it. Well, so much to like about Gerard Moreno and his overall game. Lee, what do you expect we'll see from him today? Well, I love watching him. He's got quick feet, quick mind. He wants you to come close to you so he can get past you. So as defenders normally stand off him, and then he's got more time to pick the pass he wants, and he normally finds the best one. Gerard Moreno. Manu Trigueros has it. Keeping the ball moving. Paco Alcata. Pau Torres. Now with Alcata. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. Gerard Moreno. Mario Gaspar getting in there to intercept. Christian Estuani. Here's Cristoforo. Juan Pe. Gumbau. On to Estuani. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Alcantar. Gerard Moreno. Parejo. And Alcantar. Manu Trigueros. Chukwese. They really look after the ball when they have it. Manu Trigueros. Parejo. Gerard Moreno. Showing a real will to win the ball. Parejo. Manu Trigueros has it. Gaspar. Parejo, here's Moreno, can they take advantage, can they put it away, well it came to nothing in the end, but a shocking pass really, well Villarreal certainly enjoying the lion's share of possession, but that doesn't lead to goals necessarily, they haven't created enough, too slow up front, midfield, very average, the coach, he's not happy at all. He wants more from this team. Manu Trigueros. And here's Gerard Moreno. Alcacer. Has plenty of know-how in the ball-shielding department. And they find a gap in the defence. Must take the lead here. And they have... You've got to say, it has been coming. Well, here we we'll see it again. Some lovely quality passing. Fluid as you like. And how strong was he here? Incredible to hold off the defenders and get his shot away. Lovely goal.
Well, just look at the reactions on the touchline. They just need to keep their composure now. This is far from over. 1 0 then. Gol del Villarreal. Con el siete. Now the managers will now deliver their half time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. Well, Gerard Moreno certainly wasn't quiet in the first 45. Lee, interested to get your thoughts. Well, his manager will be delighted with him. He's been spot on in this game, hasn't he? Energy, imagination, desire, and a steely determination. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Juan Pe, Gumbau, Christian Estuani. Here's Cristoforo. On to Estuani. Joel Barcenas. And in with a real chance. Takes it on. And they've done it to square the game once again. Exhilarating. Well, here's the replay, and it's a decent move to evade the defender. And he had choices of what type of finish to apply. And bang, he goes for the smash. Lovely goal. Well, a penny for his thoughts right now, Derek. Plan B, I think, is needed. Well, the earlier goal cancelled out. What a piece. Con el 23, Joel Bárcenas. Manu Trigueros. What a pass that lacks quality. A bit of running room now on the wing. Christian Estuani still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead but not forcing it Samu Saiz it's with Samu Saiz it looks promising well nothing productive really well let's see what they have in store for them on the break looks as though they might make real progress on the counter attack not so Joel Barcenas and now passing it through oh yes it's gone in and now a chance for them to revel in the moment well here's the goal again it's a clever ball through and a great run and then through on goal do you go for placement or do you go for power well he certainly wasn't messing around was he absolutely smashes it past the keeper it's a really lovely finish Well, 2 1 it is here. Girona, con el siete, Villarreal enjoying the bulk of possession, but after that, it's been really disappointing. Players are looking at each other. You've got to take control, you've got to take responsibility yourself. Make something happen in this game. He's given us away. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw in. Gumbau. Will he play it in? Sice. Just knocking it around, looking to carve out a chance. Barcenas. Here's Cristoforo. Can they convert? It did look on for them, but not to be. Inside the last quarter of an hour. 
Take some progress with the ball at his feet. And the keeper making sure that there were no scraps to feed on for the attackers. Sebastian Cristoforo. And unable to keep possession. And that pass could be troublesome. And he scored not once but twice. They simply cannot stop him. And no wonder he's enjoying himself. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. There's still a lot of work to be done, but the keeper presents the near post on a plate, and he's punished. That's quite remarkable. Well, that's a tale of four goals in this match now. Three, one it is. Pedraza. Now Parejo. Manu Trigueros. And here's Gerard Moreno. And back with Moreno. Parejo. Here's Moreno. And if you're wondering about added time, two minutes it'll be. And just the one minute left in normal time here. Gumba. Might be able to set up the chance. Can he take advantage? And still an opportunity. And there goes the final whistle. Not the result the fans were hoping for, Lee. Well, everybody connected to the club will be disappointed with today's game. Not only because of the defeat, but the manner of that defeat. That's what hurts. Way below the standards they set themselves, Derek. And I think it's accurate to say, Lee, that this man was the light bringer for his side. Well, clearly the difference between the two sides today. Two goals, a really good performance. Ran into the channel, did everything right. Absolutely, 9 out of 10.